It's time for Ryan's Rose Public Service. If you think someone is cheating on you and you want to get to the bottom of it, that's what this is about. And obviously, you submit via email, and then we get you on the phone to see if you want to make the call. Here's the email we got from Tustin. Dear Ryan, a friend of mine saw my fiance kiss another girl while waiting at the valet stand at a restaurant. I haven't asked him about it yet because I don't want this to be about my friend. I need to know the truth. Things have not been great between us lately, and it appears he's turned to another woman. All right, let's grab Gabriella now. I have a couple of thoughts on this. Gabriella, how are you? Um, I mean, I've, I've been better, but I'm okay, well, I guess. First off, we are certain that this was your fiancé that was kissing another woman at a valet stand. Certain? Yes, it was It was definitely him. Like, I, I mean, and like things haven't been really good between us as of right. recent anyways, but... Yeah, there was, there's no doubt that... That seems I mean, high risk. Was this in your area of where you live? Yeah, my friend saw him out at a restaurant that like we've all been to before. This and is really high risk. Uh, yeah, I mean, this all lies on your friend, so you trust would, your friend? Yeah, would your friend ever make this up? No. No, I'm, I'm, I'm like 100% sure. How long have that, you been engaged? We've been together for like three years. <sighs> a couple things. Your friend did not let them know. Obviously, your friend didn't let them know that she saw them. No, she okay. she left after she saw them. Did she tell you what kind of kiss it was? Like, was it a peck or was it like a makeout sesh? It was like in between. It, um, it was like more than a peck, but it was like 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 full lips, like lip oh. around lip. Like, no, I, I I will do a hello you know, on the lips every once in a while. So was saying, it a like, hello goodbye? No, it wasn't like a like a smooch. But it was definitely more than a hey, hey, buddy. So, Gabriella, I need you to say, Ryan, you have my permission to call and then whatever your fiance's name is on Kiss FM. Ryan, you have my permission to call my fiance on Kiss FM. All right, we're going to make this call. We're going to find out what's going on here and try and get to the bottom of it. Sissony is in for Patty, who's on maternity leave, mm-hmm. and we want to. We want to get the name of the person he sends these roses to. Could be you, could be somebody else, and then what kind of sentiments on the card, okay? Okay. Good luck. Here we go. Hello? Hi, may I speak to Martin? Uh, yes. Hi, Martin. My name is Crystal. I'm calling from Heavenly Flowers. We're a new flower shop here in Tustin. How are you doing this morning? I'm okay. How are you? I'm good. I mean, you know, I'm actually calling because you've been chosen to receive um, a free dozen roses. And I Um, wanted to know if you wanted to send them to anybody today. They're absolutely free. I'm doing a new promotion because I just opened up my new flower shop and calling like 10 people today. So you're one of the lucky 10. I'm just curious. How do do you guys get the numbers that you get? Yeah. Oh, sorry. I should have told you that probably. Um... You might have bought something online maybe like in the last year or so and opted out or opted to receive some promotional offers. So that's where we get all of our, you know, information from when we call winners. Okay, cool. Um, so it's free. I don't have to give you any credit card info or anything nope. like that? Nope, and they, they'll they get them today if you want um, or a different day this week or whatever's you know, more convenient for you. I just need the name you want to send them to in like a quick note so oh, we can cool. start with the name. Um, yeah, uh... Definitely Desiree. Okay, Desiree. It's D E S I R E. Uh huh. And then uh, I think it's going to say like for you from Martin. I, I want it to say that. I just don't want it to say love, Martin. Can you oh, just, just for you. For you from Martin. From Martin. Martin, it's Ryan Seacrest in Sicily, and your voice is being broadcast on the radio. I need you to know that we have your fiance. Gabriella on the line. <sighs> Who yeah. is Desiree? Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah, who is Desiree? What's going on? Who, who's who is Desiree? Why don't you just answer him? Who's Desiree? Who is Desiree? Uh, slow down. Who's the who's Desiree. this woman, Desiree, bro? Why don't you just answer him. Who's Desiree? Why 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 are you kissing? Wait, well, hold on, Gabriella. No, hold, on. hold on, Martin. Gabriella. Who who's no, who's? I don't know who, what you guys are. Why I don't know what this is like. Wh- no, bro. Gabriella, it's over. Like, remember a few weeks ago, like you said, and I quote, this isn't working for me. And I said, maybe we should take a break. That's what we're doing. So you guys she aren't said, engaged? She said, this isn't working for me. Gabriella, is that the case here? Are you telling us a different story? 
It, no, I mean, I I still have like you. I still what, what am I'm wearing a, your ring? Are you kidding? No, hold hold on for a second, gonna... guys. Well, let me let, <sighs> let's try and understand this, okay? Are the you engaged? Are you engaged right now? Uh, we're not right now because she said let's take a break. This isn't working for me. And so I Gabrielle, said, did you agree that? So we're did you that. suggest that you guys should take a break? Well, things were, we're just getting really, really b- difficult between us. I didn't know, like, we're not, now we're not together anymore. Now you're just kissing other girls. Hold, like, hold, yes. Did you agree to take a break, Gabriella? I'm still wearing the ring, though. But I'm asking you I if you I'm agree. If, we, we already went through this, uh, Mr. Seagrass. Uh, I, I told you, you can keep it. It's fine, and that's fine. And we're taking a break. And, and you know what? I don't even know who... Who your friend okay. is that said you saw me with Desiree? I don't understand. Who was it? Wait, so it, it was matter? Desiree. It All right, so wait. Also, so it was, we so you were, so we just You were at the valet it. stand. You were at the valet stand with Desiree. Got it. Okay, now, what's the, what's going on with you and the other woman? Why were you at dinner with her at this restaurant, and why were you kissing her? Are you seeing her? Yes, this is somebody I'm seeing because we're, we, we agree that we're not going to be together anymore. Boy, this, so, this inspires know. a whole what other conversation about? about what the definition of a break is, especially yeah. in an engagement, and we're going to get to that. But Gabriella, Martin, I, I don't know what to, to say. If, if you made, when you, when you made the decision to take a break and you said to each other, look, we're going to explore other options or we're going to have, the rules suspended, mm-hmm. then I'm not so sure Martin's at fault. And Gabrielle, I'm, I'm a little confused because you didn't tell us this at the beginning. Yeah. Well, if we, I'm, if we, I don't know. We're, st- we're, st- I don't know. We're, st- we're not together then. So that's, so that's it. It's just over. Like you don't love no, me anymore. No, Gabby. Gabby, remember. Love you, dude. Mm. Gabby, we had an understanding. Don't you remember that we had this talk already? We had a whole talk. We had two, three talks about this. And I said, do you want to take a break? And you said, that's it. That's what we're doing. <sighs> All right, guys, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna put you on hold for just a second, okay? I don't know where to go with this one. I she, feel so she, bad. Well, well, first of all, she's we starting to cry. Yeah, but she didn't give us I know, all this information. I know, but it seems like they're just so confused. Right, but there's egg on our face because she didn't give us all this information. And now let me let me we're gonna come back with this conversation because yeah. I don't know I don't know which way to direct them. It sounds like they got problems, okay? And if he's seeing, I want to know woman, how long this break was. Well, let's talk about when you take a break. How people understand what that break is? Yeah, because when a guy takes a break. It's, and we really go through the definition of we're on a break, right? He's going to go out with someone else. Gosh. I don't How know. How long after? Like, what? I don't know if, if women feel the same way. Pigs. Okay, Tanya, okay, clearly. That's a excessive. No, it's true. You're taking, you agree to take a break, so it's clearly a problem. It's a break from just your, 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 your I think you have to, I think everybody defines a break differently. I, I have, I have, ha- listen, I have been in relationships, not engaged, in relationships where we say, you know what? Before we take this next step, yeah. let's just make sure that we're right for each other. We should possibly just explore. Why? Then just break up. Yes. Because that's hard. No, we're, we're, it's because guys don't like confrontation. So you guys are like, let's just take little baby steps and take this little break.